Adam Collard is undoubtedly one of the best looking men to grace our televisions. And he didn't just get here naturally. We are dishing all of his secrets. And if there is one thing to know for sure, it is that his workouts are brutal in the best way. With his perfect six pack, Adam Collard has had everyone going crazy since he starred on Love Island and Celebs Go Dating. He practically has to beat girls off of him. However, Collard is more like the rest of us than you would think. If, you, if you're struggling with something, you can't say, I don't want this after you've put yourself in yeah. that situation. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? You, you kind get, of ask for it. And I, I've got to be honest, like the Love Island team, the Love Island producers and stuff like that now mm-hmm. very much make it clear what is going to happen. Just like the rest of us mortals, Adam Collard has his own insecurities too. Adam Collard was not always the six foot five star that we see now. He was actually overweight as a child, leading to some depression. When speaking about his huge transformation, he said, there's a couple of things that wind us up about the TV. I've got a little chip on my shoulder. I can't lie. One of them is the misconception that the gym started before Love Island. Everyone thinks that I went on the TV the first time and then got the gym after. The gym was already established. I was a PT from 18 years old. I went on Love Island when I was 22, but my gym had already been open for a year. Just like a lot of people out there, I was not happy with the way I looked. 16 was the minimum age back in my day when you could get a gym membership. So me and my best friend signed up. We didn't really have a routine. We did a lot of reading forums, got a routine off there, and fell in love with all of the early days YouTubers Steve Cook, Christian Guzman, Greg Plitt, legends. It was deep. I think that, and I'm glad it happened now, but those kids in school, you wear glasses, you get cold for glasses you've got race you've got hair color you've got whatever it is mine was being overweight and they caught it was and i think that that was the chip on the shoulder that i needed to go collard went from being the chunky insecure kid to now being a fitness inspiration and running his own gyms despite his success from reality tv he is still very present in his gyms and even knows his members by name his brand primal is strength training equipment forged in glasgow According to the Primal website, they design the finest strength training equipment to help any and everybody improve their health and well-being and discover a strength they didn't know they possessed. Since his time on Love Island, Adam didn't just fade into the background. He has leveraged his newfound fame to boost his career in fitness and social media. He continues working as a personal trainer and shares fitness tips, workout routines, and motivational posts with his followers. His Instagram is packed with fitness content, showing off his ripped physique and offering advice on how to get in shape. Adam is all about balance and consistency. I think that's why I train a little bit more performance-based than aesthetic-only based now, Mm -hmm. because it's not just about looking perfect all the time and doing stuff like that. I try to be fit, I try to be strong, I try to think about performance goals instead, and that tries to, that that kind of keeps a lid on me being obsessed about weight loss, weight loss, weight loss, and being lean and stuff like that. He hits the gym regularly, usually working out six days a week. His routine is a mix of weightlifting, cardio, and functional training, ensuring that he covers all aspects of fitness. He focuses on different muscle groups each day, which helps him maintain a well-rounded and muscular physique.